What is up guys, it's Penguin Typer here, back with another video, and I finally got around to not making a pre-recorded video, and the reason I was doing a lot of that, and my channel was kind of like going downhill a tiny bit, you know, the subs weren't increasing as much as usual, the views weren't going up too much, um, was because I kind of lost interest in YouTube for a good week or two, um, some just like stuff in my personal life, I wasn't really feeling into it, and for good reasons of course. Um, but I feel like now it's time to like get back into the flow of YouTube, start uploading new videos, um, and start making cool content for you guys. So yeah, I'm just going to talk about that quickly. And what I'm going to be talking about today is how to customize your nice type version three page. So I've done one video on how to get the, uh, green type things before that was on old nitro type V2. Because a lot of you guys asked for it, and no one's asked for how do I get this style on my Nitrodrive V3 page. And that's probably because I haven't posted any current up-to-date videos, so you guys haven't even seen this. But, there's this thing, it's called Stylish, and I'm not just saying I'm not paid to advertise this. This is completely just letting you guys know through my own personal experience through it. Nope, that's not it. Um, <laughs> it's like... There's something. It's, um, open styles or user styles. Oh my god. Yeah, userstyles.org. It's a, um, jeez, I can't even think. It connects with a, uh, um, Chrome add on called Stylish. And what happens is you get to search, um, the site for basically any website that has themes for it. So I'll go with NitroType. And people have made different, like, themes or, like, textures with for the Nitrodype itself. And there's a, as you can see, there's a bunch here. Um, Nitrodype Blue, Nitrodype Purple, Nitrodype Pink. Those are all old ones that worked with V2. And then, if you see, like, V3 in the box, you'll see that it's a new V3 one that'll work with V3. So, the first one I would like to talk about today was made by, oh, shoot. Was this one made by, oh, I can't even remember. Ah, uh, so there, I have, I have, uh, three I want to go over today, and the first one, yeah, okay, it was made by Syed, I, I very much apologize if I pronounce your name wrong, Syed, S-Y-E-D, no, I'm from the Nudge Discord, and it's what you're seeing right now, it turns this, hold on, give me a second, it turns this, which is the basic boring, oh, never mind, oh my gosh, I have so many styles on, it's actually insane. Uh, sorry. It's like boring old Nitrodive V3 into this. Which is, like, really cool and, like, just a really nice theme. And, like, the background's really nice. Uh, if I scroll down, I think the garage looks very, very good. And I can go to, like, other pages, too. I'll just go to, like, stats, say, and I'll go to, like, leaderboards. But all in all, I think Sad did an amazing job with this theme. It looks really, really nice, as you can see. Um, it's the one I actually like the most so far. And I, I just really, really love it. I'm going to, like, achievements so you guys can see what's... Check that out. And if you go to uh, userstyles.org, just search Nitrotype, and then go to... Uh, give me a second. I think just this just looks amazing to my eyes right now, and I love it. Userstyles.org, search Nitrotype. When this loads, come on, nitro type, something like that. And then go to, uh, where is it? Nitro type vibrant. What on earth? Sorry, search nitro. What is happening? Is it vibrant? NT. Oh, sorry. You got to search NT Vibrant, and then it'll pop up right here. And as you can see, it already has 16 odd downloads, or like 16 people have used this and are using it, and I think it looks really nice. I'll update it, because why not? So yeah, that's the first one. Uh, let me know how you like that one. The second one is made by... um. Oh, shoot. It is made by Dvorak, pretty well known in the Nitrotype community, and it's supposed to take what V3 is now, which looks like this, 
and actually revert it back to the old V2 look. And he spent so much time on this. Like, it's qu it's quite insane. He literally spent, I think, uh, I can't even remember, but it was like 40 hours designing this. And as you can see, it looks so much like the old Nitro type. So if you guys are missing the old and you just want it back, you can install the Vorex style, which is Nitro type, Nitro type Classic, I think. Nitro type V3 Classic theme by Dvorak. It's amazing. I think he did a wonderful job with it. Um, next up, last theme I'm going to do today. And if you guys um, want to make your own themes or submit them, you got to know a bit of CSS, which is coding language. But um, once you learn, it's pretty easy to pick up. Then it's really cool, and you can make some awesome stuff with it. Now, last one is by Dive Deep. Pretty cool character. And what he made is a uh, summer type theme. So as you can see, this is, I really like this one as well. Like all three of them are amazing. But the one I, uh, the reason I like this one is because the garage. Um, in the background, there's a picture of, like palm trees and blue sky, nice clouds. We got the shadow floaty over on the left. There were hammer wheels over on the right. And in the middle, we have the garage or like the profile page where we have this really nice sunset on the beach looks amazing it blends really really well with the background i, th I think it, he's done a wonderful job dive deep when in making this summer themes um <laughs> summer themed um style now of course i'm going to i'm going to use this for season 23 when it's more of a summery type um season or as to like kind of um take place of the summer event but for now i'm using seds theme which is like all kind of like geometry type vibrant colors i guess um dive deeps theme which is nitro type summer i think yeah nitro type summer theme it's more of a summery type like feel beachy stuff and um dvorax was the whole like nitro type v2 going back to the old style of everything so i think um the three people who i talked about today said um Dvorak and Dive Deep all did amazing jobs with their styles. I think uh, a lot of time was put into these. And if you guys want to make your own, you certainly can. Let me know down in the comment section which one you actually like the best. Because I'm still trying to decide, honestly. I can't really choose. There's just so much like good content that's being created out of this uh, stylish. And stylish, if you want to like install it, it's just a Google Chrome add-on. Go to Chrome Store. You install it. It's really, really easy. So yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. Um, I'm trying to get back into the whole YouTube flow of things, so I'll be trying to make more and more content for you guys. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching. And have a wonderful day.